Hi, my name is Dex from My Consult, and today we're looking at how we can actually do a manual backup in auto count. All right. So in My Consult, we definitely recommend you to do this process weekly if you can't do it daily, and make sure that you backup the file into the cloud or an external hard disk for safekeeping. So first of all, you need to make sure that your user has access to backup the database. So you can come here to Tools here, and we have Backup here. That means you can actually backup the file. All right. So let's click Backup. Alright, so on default, they actually have three different locations that you can actually predetermine or pre save already here. Alright, so let's say, example, today if I want to back up to my des desktop, so let's press backup to. Alright, so the backup process will begin depending on how big your database and, of course, your computer performance. Alright, so let's say, for example, if I want to back up in a different location, so all I just need to do is we just press browse, let's press update here. And let's say we want to save in documents, so go DAX, and then after that, let's say we go documents and press OK. So press OK. So then now we got a different location, and we can also press backup to here, and we can actually run the process, and it will backup into your documents folder. All right. So this is actually how easy it is to backup your file in AutoCount. Do like and subscribe to be notified when we release a new guide weekly. Thank you.